Welcome to the channel. Today we have a special guest, Abby, and we're reviewing her 2021 Specialized Status. Stick around to the end of the video to figure out this is the perfect bike for you. If you like these type of videos, please like and subscribe to the channel. This is my brand new Specialized Status 140 in cast metallic and clay. This bike is a size S2, and if you don't already know, it's a mullet, which means it's a 29er up front and a 27.5 in the back. So business up front, party in the back. Up front, the bike has a 150 millimeter Fox 36 rhythm. In the back, the bike is equipped with a Fox Float DPX2 performance to get you over whatever the trail has to throw at you. For stopping power, Specialized has provided Code R brakes, which have endless bite. I've had the pleasure of riding this bike, and to be honest, I had some pretty big expectations going into it. I've always been a big fan of the mullet bikes, even thought about converting my Santa Cruz Nomad into a mullet bike by putting a 29er up front. If you haven't already, please check out the review on that bike. The first thing I noticed about this bike is how comfortable it is. Instantaneously, my first run down the trail, the bike felt super fun and playful. What I really liked about the bike is up front, you had all the advantage of the 29er by just tackling any line that you take. And then out back, it's still very playful. I uh, never found the rear tire getting in the way of, like I do with a traditional 29er bike. Compared to the 27 and a half inch bike, this bike did feel a little bit slower in the turn in initially. After riding the bike a few times down the trail, I was fully adjusted to it. I really like how lean back and slack the bike feels. Overall, even going into this with high expectations for the mullet bike, I really do think that these bikes are the future. I've had a chance to ride this status and coming off the old 29er Enduro and currently riding the new 29er, this is a nice change of pace. With the 27.5 in the rear, it's a bit more playful and kind of feels like a mini DH bike in a way. I had a 2013 status in the past and that was a full downhill oriented bike and this is a lot more playful and friendly on the trail. You can really go anywhere on this bike. It's very exciting to see them having fun with the wheel sizes. The 29 up front feels really planted and the 27.5 in the rear, you can just slide around and have a lot of fun. Overall, this is a great bike to get if you're new to riding or an experienced rider who just wants a really fun bike. 